Hello there, everyone. So, um, if you ever heard, I do have a Thunderbolt 1000T siren now. That's like all that's on my mind here in the past few days. But, um, unlike my last siren project, uh, I did not really post very many videos of how the restoration process was going on. So for this project, I do want to make day-by-day -day videos of the progress I make on the siren. So, we have, uh... Me and the buddies who are working on the siren have gotten through our first day of siren restoration. Um, now, uh, so now I'm going to tell you about what we did. So, uh, I'm actually making this the day after the, the uh, restoration because we actually did it yesterday. So, obviously I'm not there to actually show you the siren, you know, right then and there. But... I do have part of the chopper motor right here that's sitting on my desk. Now, you're probably asking, why the heck do you have it in your room? Well, we had to locate what was wrong with the tornado siren, why the, the whole reason why it came down in the first place, and this is why. So this is the, the, this is the uh, electric field portion of the siren, of the chopper motor. And what we found, uh, I'll pick it up and show you, hopefully as best as I can. If, if you can see right there on your right, that right side of the coils, this thing's really heavy. The coils are burnt up. The insulation broke down and these coils are shot. They are burnt. So that's the whole reason why the siren came down. These coils burnt up, causing the siren to be inoperable. Now, why why it happened, we don't know. Could have been a lightning strike, could have been anything. So, what we're going to do is we're going to get this thing recoiled. It's going to it'll cost a little bit of money, but not not as much as replacing the whole chopper. We'll recoil the this uh, motor here. It uh, should be good as new. The rest of the chopper is in great condition. Um, so that's about all we did. We did a, we did a few other things as well, and I'll uh, share you share some pictures with you of uh, uh, other things that we did on that day with the siren. But uh, that's what we've done so far. Our next work day is next Friday, so it'll be about a about a week from now, of six days from now. We're gonna work on it some more. So uh, all right, enjoy these pictures. video there's where the blower once was yeah yeah ah. yeah remember all the those everstart batteries were laying on the ground yesterday <laughs> yeah that's I'm gonna take a quick picture from back here. Huh? I said I'm gonna take a quick picture. 